How's it going, guys? It's Rockman Luigi, and welcome back to more Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2. Last time, we did a lot more of uh, World 4. We didn't just do the one galaxy. We got to do the uh, Flipsville, Honey Hop, and uh, Starshine Beach Galaxy, which is... I like that galaxy a lot, like I said, because it's a nice little uh, nostalgia touch from uh, Super Mario Sunshine. And in this part, I think we're going to be possibly finishing up World 4. I'm not totally sure. But before we get started, please be sure to hit that like button. This is going to be the last part that needs to hit 25 likes. Uh, so far, uh, 7 through 9. I think I started doing this at part 7. 7 through 9 all hit uh, the 25 like goal, or at least broke or got past the 25 like goal. Uh, part 10's been up for maybe like a little over an hour when this is being recorded. So we'll see. This might uh, end up being the last part we have, have 25 likes for, and then we'll be going to 30. But... Without further ado, let's get started. We're going to be starting the new galaxy now, which is a Chopworks galaxy. And then we're going to be need to do in that we're going to need to do this. I actually might have to end up going off screen unfortunately to get star bits unless some com some comets appear. I'm not I'm not sure. I might have to end up going off screen to get 1200 cuz I don't even have 800 yet. But here we are where the chops are made of gold. I'm not, I mean, I kind of like this galaxy. I like the whole, like, aspect of it. Where you have to, like, lure chops into certain areas to, uh, progress on. I, I like that. It's just, I, I don't know. This, this isn't one of my more favorite galaxies, I'd say. I mean, I don't, I don't hate it, but, I don't know. But you can actually step on these platforms to make them go down. And usually they hide star bits and stuff. Well, I guess that one didn't hide anything. And I guess we're gonna have to go up here. Wait, do these sink? Yeah, they do. Alright. Oh, the, I forgot about the comp metal. Oh, shit. Come on, make it. Damn it, Mario. Fuck. Okay, can make it, make it. Okay, backflip. Perfect. Okay. That, that can be a little bit tricky to get. Can't even lie. Can't even lie. Alright, hit that switch. And this is gonna lower. And then I think we have to... Yeah, we have to hold this down in order for the chop to progress. Because if that platform is up, then, uh, as you can see, that chop will break. This is basically what we're going to be doing for the entire mission. And then eventually they're going to give us a gold chomp and we're going to have to lure that into like a... Into an area and it's like a really big puzzle. The uh, comet is really, really tough for this one in my opinion. The comet is so fucking hard. Oh my god! Damn it! Oh, bullshit! Uh, no, 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 no. I'm scared, I'm scared, I'm scared. Okay, let me just backflip. I, I think that's easier. Okay, can I make it over there? <laughs> I'm, I'm honestly scared now. What the f... Okay, thank god they offer some coins. Oh, uh, we're gonna have to lure one all the way through this. And we're gonna have to... Okay, let's see. Oh, okay, okay. We, ha we, have to hit this we have to hit this button first. Okay. So, he's gonna... Okay, red. Oh, no, we're not gonna... Okay, red. Let me, let me, let me... Yes, he made it. Boom. Come on, 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 don't get squished. There we go. See, as you can tell, it gets progressively harder, you know? It's it's a really cool mechanic that they added, you know? That's what I love about this game so much. I've said it before. It's just every new galaxy has a different mechanic to it. It's just, it's amazing. Okay, I think we're going to need to hit this. Uh, this just raises us up so we can get coins. It's only, in, see, it's only in there for like a split second, too. It's really strange. But do we need to hit this one? No, we don't. We're gonna need to hit- we're gonna need to time that with the gold chomp, though, eventually. See, that's the gold chomp. What's- what you're gonna want to do first, this is probably your best bet. You're definitely gonna want to take out these helmeted Goombas first. Because you would need to lure the chomp all around this entire path. And the, uh, the helmeted Goombas just get in your way. What's really good, though, is I don't think the helmeted Goombas respawn. But you're definitely gonna just want to kill them. The first- first hand before you- even come in close contact with the gold chop. If, if you if you leave the, the helmeted Goombas on, this is really fucking hard. If, if, if I, I don't think I've ever seen somebody do it with all the helmeted Goombas on the path. If you can do that, kudos to you. And if you have done it by any chance, tell me in the comments because you, sir, get respect. Okay, this is actually... That, that one's kind of tough since it's uh, facing vertically. Okay, trying not to fall in the lava. It's really, really odd angling right there. Okay, I'm gonna want to... Get decently ahead, and then right when he gets out of the blue, ground pound. If you ground pound too early or too late, then he will end up getting squashed. But there we go. The comet for this is really tough because you're basically just doing this part of the mission, 
but you have, like, five cosmic clones following you. It's really fucking tough, considering how narrow the paths are. You have to, like, do it perfectly. But anyways, we got our perfect star. <laughs> Uh-oh, looks like we have a letter. This might be an important one. Oh, yeah, this is the Guillermo I was talking about. Help wanted. That was the one, like, way back. I think that might have been, like, part four or something. Where I said that you have to help a Guillermo lure, like, a Goomba into a cage. That's the mission right there. So, I guess we're going to Boulder Bowl Galaxy, and then we'll continue on with Chompworks, alright? Okay, here we are in Boulder Bowl, and it's in the Rock and Roll Adillo mission. Uh, the Guillermo that you need to talk to for the secret mission is on the planet. That's right before Rolladillo, where you have to break the giant crystal in the lo to unveil the Sling Star, and there's like a bunch of chomps and uh, boulders and stuff. So, I guess I'll just meet you guys at that planet, okay? Wait, time out. I just want to show off Luigi first. <laughs> I want to get Luigi, and then I will meet you guys at the planet. Actually, no, wait. I want to show off, uh, I want to really show off real quick what, uh, Rock Luigi looks like. Just cause, why not? Okay. Cause I don't think we've seen a glimpse of Rock Luigi yet, so I kinda wanna show him off. Piece of shit. You can barely see him because the fucking glass was in the way. Alright, there he is. He's beast. And we can roll him the rocks. Okay. Now I will meet you guys at the planet where the Guillermo is. Alright, here we are. Now we just need to look for Mr. Guillermo. Where is he at? Guillermo, where are you? Okay, I know for a fa- There he is, okay. See, what makes this really tough is having to lure the Goomba off of the mud path and you can't have him get hit by the chops either. That's what makes this makes this hard. I'm not, even, I'm not even sure where the Goomba is on the planet. Maybe we can work out a trade. See, you have to get the Goomba into this little gate. I'm really into collecting one of those Goomba guys. Think you could bring me, bring me one? Or think you can bring me one? What the fuck? Okay. You should be close by, I hope. You know, let me just kill these Octo or Elite Octumbas first, just to get them the fuck out of the way. Shit, where- I don't know where the Goomba is on this planet, that's the fucking issue. You know what, actually, he might be in one of these rocks. I'm not even kidding, he actually might be in one of those Stalagmites. Oh shit, 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 shit. Maybe- <sighs> I might have to, like, cut out until I find this thing. I legit do not know where it is. Okay, maybe it's in this one. It's gotta be. It's gotta be. It's gotta be in one of these three. Because I'm literally not seeing it loose on the planet at all. Yep, there he is. Okay, wait. Wait for that chomp to move. Go, 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 go. No, don't no, crap! Don't run into the... Are you kidding me? Why did he... I don't understand why he stopped and then... Okay, we might only have two shots here. That's what makes this tough. Okay, let me lure. Come here, come here, come here, come here. Come on, go, 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 go. Yes, yes, okay. Okay, come here, come into the mud, come into the mud. Rock, 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 rock. No, 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 come on. Oh my God. Okay, hold on. I might have to get rid of these boulders. Time out. I might, I might have to get rid of these. That, that screwed me. I would have, I would have gotten it. Come on, I, I sh- Okay, you know what? I'm just gonna cut until I do this. This mission is honestly getting me annoyed. Alright, I'll cut until I figure this out. Okay, I'm back. You know what's really, really annoying? Oh, I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. I did not mean to do that. Please do not follow me, Goomba. What's really annoying is I'm pretty sure, pretty sure, you only have two tries to do this. And of course I bounced off the gear mode. Okay, hold on. You only have two tries to do this. I'm pretty sure there's only two Goombas available on this planet. So if the Goombas die, you have to leave the mission because they don't respawn. So what I'm going to do is take out as much of these boulders as I possibly can. The bol the Not the chops, but the regular boulders. Come on, I'm not trying to break this. Ugh. Oh, nope, there's still a boulder. And I cannot keep the Goomba from following me. It's impossible. He just keeps on following me. See, he's not even like... How? I was behind the stalagmite. Okay. Stop following me, you piece of shit. Where's the boulder at? There it is. Come here. Perfect. 
Okay, thank God. Apparently, me going into that still sticking out platform doesn't stop me from rolling. Okay, come here. Come here. Come here. You know what? No, wait. Yeah, come here. 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 Okay. Come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on, come on! Please, yes! Oh my god. There's actually another mission in this game that's similar to this, and I swear to god, the, that one that's in World 5 is easier than this. The one in World 5 is so much easier than, so much easier than this. You know, because you're going... In, in the other one, you're going vertically, not horizontally like this, and you have the fucking mud. It's just so annoying, but I'm glad we're done. Okay, wait, looks like we have a fucking, uh, I think we have a gear mode coming on board, honestly. That, that mission honestly kind of put me in a little bit of a bad mode, I can't even lie. That shit was really fucking irritating. And I really hated how Luigi appeared in such an annoying ass bullcrap mission. Oh boy, tell me you didn't bring back a gear mode with you this time, well, put it somewhere out of the way. Maybe we want to relax for a bit, okay. Yeah, okay, we're done with that. Thank the fucking lord. And I guess we're gonna go back to Chompworks now. Because that's the only thing left we can do. So I'll meet you guys in Chompworks. Alrighty, we're back and we're gonna be springing into Chompworks. And this is where we get the Spring Mushroom, which is nice. Because I, I've always been fond of the Spring Mushroom. A lot of people hate it, but I kind of like it. And it's kind of a shame because this is the only mission in the game where we get to use the Spring Mushroom. See, this is what I mean where... A lot of the veteran power-ups from Galaxy are, like, ridiculously underused. Like, the Spring Mushroom and the Boom Mushroom, and we're not going to be able to see the Boom Mushroom until World 5. Those two power-ups, you literally only use once. Which I really don't like. And then the Cloud Suit is used in, like, almost every other fucking Galaxy. You know? It's like, I don't understand why they overuse that power-up so much. Like, I know it's new, but I mean, so is the Rock Suit, and the Rock Suit's really not used that much. The Rock Suit's maybe used in, like, a couple Galaxies? I'd say. It's maybe using like two, two, maybe three galaxies. Okay. But the spring mushroom really isn't that difficult to use. You just hold A right when you're about to land to get a big jump. And we're gonna have to use it to get over these chomps. Sometimes it's just better to maybe even not use the spring mushroom. If you're not used to the spring mushroom's controls, you can just not use the spring mushroom and just regularly triple jump. Oh, fuck, 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 fuck. There we go. Okay. This is a really narrow path. E. No, 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 what? He keeps bouncing off the wall. I'm not even trying to. It's really annoying. Get all the... That's so cool. I'll have the form of chop. This mission is really, really short, though. This is literally the home stretch. We just have to get up this tower with the spring mushroom when we're done. This is a really, really quick mission. I mean, it could be kind of long for spring mushroom noobs, but I'm decent with it. It's just kind of hard to turn with it in midair. That's the only thing. Yeah, see, I, I, I was, like, literally holding the left stick as much as possible. I barely got any, any, uh, distance with it right there. See, so barely made that, too. It's, you have to, like, pre-hold or, like, do it while you're in the middle of jumping in that direction. It's really weird. Okay. And this is where it goes. Oh, come on. I hit A. I, I held A. Why did he not jump? Okay. Boing, boing. Boing, there we go. This gets a little bit tricky because the platforms are moving, so you just want to keep jumping as much as possible. And there we go. That took maybe under a minute. That was quick as hell. <laughs> and it looks like the spring mushroom is going into our inventory now. Makes sense because this is literally the last time we're going to see the spring mushroom, unfortunately. Okay. Okay. Oh, looks like we got the uh, unfortunate Cosmic Clone Comet that I was talking about appearing in Chopworks now. Eek. Really not looking forward to that. That took me, that I swear to God, that comet took me so many tries when I did it in my original file of this game. But, wait, wait, wait. This is a, a spring, huh? So you wear that? Does it make a big boing sound when you poke it? Har, har. <laughs> oh my gosh. Lubba is such a bad, bad jokes. But anyways, uh, I'll go to the mission select screen now for Chompworks again, and then hopefully we can get that comet done in one try. It's gonna be tough, but I think we can do it. Alrighty, here we go. Honestly, kind of nervous. <laughs> Cosmic clones in the Chompworks. 
I'm not sure how many cosmic clones are actually following you. It might only be three, but it might be more. See, what makes this really tough is the enemies. You're going to want to want to take out the enemies as soon as possible. It's, it's just basically the same thing as before, only you're, you can't stop moving, basically. This is what makes it tough. And I think the cosmic clones are going to spawn right about now. Yep. Okay. This is honestly really fucking difficult. Okay, let me take you out. It's good to sometimes run in circles a little bit to uh, fake out the cosmic clones just to buy yourself a little bit of time. But, I don't know. Okay, there we go. And get him off the edge. Perfect, perfect. We're doing good so far. We're doing good, we're doing good, we're doing good. Okay, let me take a loop around. There we go. Okay, maybe there- yep, there's- there's more- there's a lot following us. Holy crap, there's a lot following us. Okay. No, no, we're not gonna make it, see? This- this mission is so fucking difficult, I swear to- I swear to god. Like, you have to- You really have to, like, plan- plan your shit out, like, really. Okay, we- we have one heart. We basically have to do it in this run. I'm- I'm legit. Okay. Okay, let's hop over here. Perfect. Go slow. Go slow. Go slow. Go slow. Go slow. Go- No! No! Fuck! 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 I'm gonna die! I'm gonna die! God damn it! I should've killed those enemies for coins! See, this shit is so fucking difficult, dude. I swear! I, I honestly thought only, like, a few were following me. There's literally, like, eight of them. I, I don't know if I'm gonna be able to do this in one try. Oh, great. See? Yep. I had literally no space. Oh, my God. I... I this, this, this mission is honestly one of the hardest comets in, in World 4. Honestly, it might be one of the, one of the hardest comets in the game. Legit. Yeah, it might be up there. It might be, like, top five. I'm not even- I'm not even fucking around. Okay, now I have to loop around that motherfucker. Come on. Die, you piece of shit. There we go. Course. Course. Spin. Literally nothing happened. Okay, there we go. And I didn't make the long jump. Of fucking course. Okay. And he ran into me. I was moving, so I don't understand how he ran into me. It makes zero sense. See, this is where you're going to want to go slow as shit. <sighs> Come on. No, jump, jump, jump! Yes! Okay. What? How? Why did he... Come on! Dude! Are you fucking serious right now? Okay, at least we're back to full health. Thank God I didn't grab those coins before. Dude, this is ridiculous. I... This mission, I swear. I honestly thought I was going to be able to maybe get World 4 done. That's probably not going to be a thing. Okay, I can't believe I actually made that jump. That's pretty fucking crazy. Okay, let me go over here. Then move. Perfect, okay. Good so far. See, the problem is I'm like focusing on the chop where he's going to land, but I also have to focus on the cosmic clones so I don't get hit as it's at the same time. I honestly might have to take a hit here. I can go. Cut. Why? Oh my god. Why? Why? Why did you do it? You spin ground pound, you piece of crap. Huh. <sighs> Backflip. Huh. <sighs> if I fuck up here, I'm cutting. This is, this is ridiculous, dude. I'm never gonna get this done. Of course. Right when I got there. Right when I got there. He fucking dies. Yep. Timing's crap now. I'm probably gonna take damage. Yep. My god. This is- see- If you do this mission on your first try, you're amazing at this game. Kid, not even kidding. My god, how am I supposed to get them from getting off the goddamn platform? This is crap! Ugh. <sighs> this is crazy. Okay, we good? We're good. Slow and steady. You have to go slow, but you have to go fast also, because you have to outrun the chump. But you also can't ha be too ahead of the cosmic clones, because you have to, like, get them on, like, a good formation. 
This is crazy. Okay, here we go. Here we go. Boom! There we go. Yes! And I didn't have to take a hit either. Thank God I think we're done. Holy shit, that is fucking difficult. I only lost one life, thank God. But that took like five fucking minutes, maybe more. Oh my lord. Alright. Thank God we're done. We're done with Chompworks, I think. Wow. Um, alrighty guys. We're, uh... We're done with World 4, and I don't want to go to the boss yet. The boss. The boss yet, because... We still need to unlock this Luma. So I actually might need to go to a previous mission and get 200 star bits. Because we still need to unlock this galaxy. I'm, I'm 200 star bits short. So I think I guess I'll just meet you guys when I have the proper star bits to unlock this galaxy. Alright? Peace. Okay, we're back. That actually didn't take as long as I thought it would. I just went to uh, the first mission in Yoshi Star and just literally killed every enemy in every possible way that would give me a star bit. And I... Had got more than 200, actually. I have 1,222, so. We're only gonna have 22 star bits left, unfortunately, honestly. I think I might start using the, uh, the bank toad or whatever to put some star bits in there just so I can, uh, have more over time for situations like this, you know? I'm pretty sure the, uh, Luma in World 5 wants, like, 1,500, and I think the War Luma in World 6 wants, like, 1,600 or some shit. Ugh. But, yeah, I'm... We're gonna have to kind of get this over with. I'm really not too fond of this galaxy, honestly. It's just, it's a really long mission, and you're just using the the bulb berry the entire time. And that's my least favorite power up of Yoshi's. So this isn't really too too much fun, honestly. But let's just go in. Bulb berry's mysterious glow, sweet mystery galaxy. I like the name though. It's kind of nice. Boom, bam. Oh, you know what I just remembered? Uh, remember when I said those uh, little green duck things can't be killed. I'm pretty sure Yoshi can actually eat them. I'm almost positive that Yoshi can actually eat those things. So, maybe I was wrong when I said they were basically indestructible enemies. I'm pretty sure Yoshi can actually eat them. But let's actually put that test of theory. Yep, we can. Even though they're, they have spiked tops, we can still eat their big asses. Alright, here we go. I don't remember where the comp metal is in this one. I'm pretty sure it's kind of like... It's not really on the proper planet that it's supposed to be on, if I remember correctly. Okay, boom. Barely made that, my god. My god. Oh, maybe it's over here. Yep, it is. I was right. See, you have to, you kind of have to go out of your way to get the Comet Medal, unfortunately. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. That was fucking close as hell. That's what I mean. That Comet Medal, dude. They don't get, they don't give you a bull berry right there. It's crazy. Um. Boom. I like this music though. It's kind of nice. It's pe it's peaceful, if you will. Come here, you fat ass. There we go. God, these freaking pig ducks are so annoying. No, pig ducks? I don't even know what they are. Pig fairies? They're weird. That's basically it. I still don't know what happens when you uh have them have them on you too long. Because I know I know something happens if you keep them on your mouth too long with Yoshi, but I don't know what it is exactly. Okay, where's the platforms? Here we go. Boom, boom. I'm, I'm recovering from my bad mood, honestly. Like I said, that that mission really got me pissed off. I can't even lie. You know, I was that. Oh my God, it was just it was just difficult. You know, I, I I don't like the fact that you only get to have two Goombas. I think, unless there was a third one that I on the planet that I just was not seeing. You only get two Goombas for that shit, and I hate, I hate that. That's so irritating that you literally have to leave the mission because they don't respawn. Ugh. Enough ranting, though. Enough ranting. Let's just try to focus on the sweet mystery galaxy. This might actually might be our last one. I, I don't know if I want to do World 4. You know, this this might be a little, bit, a little bit of a shorter episode. I don't know if I want to complete Bowser. Maybe if a Comet appears, I'll do that. But the Bowser missions are just long, and I don't know if I, I, I am if I'm bleh, if I'm up for it. Fuck! Come on, jump, jump, dummy. There we go. That actually wasn't as long as I thought. I thought this mission was a lot longer, but maybe it's the comet I was thinking of. Well, looks like we got a comet in World Three. It's uh, the Daredevil run, actually, of um. 
What's his face? Uh, Mega Hammer or whatever. I guess we might as well do that. All right, so let me let me go there. Alrighty, here we go. We're gonna do a Mega Hammer Daredevil run. Honestly, though, if I end up dying on this maybe more than once, I might just end up saving it for next episode. You know, I've been even though a lot of a lot of shit is gonna get cut out. I've been, I've been recording for almost forty minutes. You know, I don't know. It's just Elgato file sizes are really big, <laughs> and my hard drive is not that big. My hard drive is maybe like. 480 gigabytes or something like that. But anyways, we already saw this fucking cutscene, so let's just hurry up with it. I... Hopefully I don't have too much trouble with this. I, I remember I got damaged last time, but it probably ended up... It shouldn't have happened, but... Maybe we... Hopefully we can do this first try. Hopefully. I was having a lot of trouble getting the, uh... The blue... Thing in the... For whatever the fuck they're called. Like, the blue orbs or whatever in his backside last last time. I was having a lot of trouble with that, so... Oh, we actually timed that right. Not even bad. I don't think I've ever timed that right before. So we're... He's, his right orb is already done. Wow, we're actually doing pretty well. <laughs> Not even gonna lie. I don't think I've ever timed that before as of me playing this game. I feel proud. Okay, let me grab that. Last second. And boom. Wow, we timed it. Wow! Maybe I'm just really bad with timing. I don't think we've ever gotten that before. Okay, let's get behind him. And there we go. Hopefully he doesn't turn around. I'm gonna try to grab this bullet bill as quick as possible. Grab it, grab it, grab it! Motherfucker, that bullet, that bullet almost got me right there. Is he gonna turn around again? Oh no, dude! We're actually doing really, really good with the timing right here. Holy crap, we actually might get this. Wait, hold on, timeout. Okay, I thought that bullet bill that was like right on top of us before was gonna end up hitting us. And right here is the easy part, so we're basically done. We don't even have to move. I, if I end up fucking up right here, I'm going to kill myself. Boom. Okay. Yeah. Oh, I'm on a... That was close. I felt like I jumped too early on that one. And there we go. Wow. I honestly did not expect me doing that first try. I did that a lot quicker and a lot better than I thought I was going to do. I haven't been doing that well this episode, so... In general, so that kind of redeemed it a little bit. But there we go. I think that might have been our sixth star for this part. So that's that's pretty good. Usually we get like seven or eight or sometimes, but six is fine. I guess we'll just be completing World 4 next part, and then we can start World 5, which is probably my favorite world in general. But yeah. I guess that's it. How, that should be uh, 66 stars, correct? Let's see. Might be 66. Yep, 66. All right. So I think we're going to stop right here. Thank you guys so much for watching, though. Please be sure to leave a like and a comment if you enjoyed. Oh, looks like the comment's there. And uh, subscribe to be updated on future uploads. And next time at Let's Play Super Mario Galaxy 2, I guess we're going to be going or starting off with um, Sweet Mr. Galaxy doing that comment. Then we'll be finishing up World 4 and starting World 5. So I'll see you guys next time. Peace out. Take care. Bye-bye.